Yes, YouTube. DJ Aaron's been having some issues tonight with his full TV and that. Uh, Flash Media Encoder decided to take a crap. It went to lunch and didn't come back. Or you can say it went on vacation and never came back. That's MIA. It doesn't want to work. I tinkered with it via Team Viewer and couldn't get it to go. Aaron tinkered with it before I got to it and I got, had the same results that he's had. Uh, what it was doing is it was stuck on uh, Windows Machine's um, profile because uh, uh, him and uh, Windows Machine were doing a co uh, broadcast on Windows Show last night. Well, Sunday night, I mean. And for some odd reason, FME wouldn't let Aaron switch profiles. Uh, and tried to load the uh, profile up for his um, his show, and it wouldn't. What it was doing it was just closing out. Like you hit the exit button. It wasn't error, it didn't come up with any error messages or anything on the screen, it just closed out. Uh, I've uninstalled it via Team Viewer. He reinstalled it. I even had him, you know, reboot a million times after uninstalling and reinstalling. And uh, I even went into the uh, Windows registry and deleted everything out of it for uh, Flash Media Encoder. And into the application data folder for uh, Flash Media Encoder. I try to delete everything possible, any any traces of Flash Media Encoder after uninstalling it. Thought uh, maybe well something was corrupted or something just wasn't uninstalling right or installing right or what have you. And well, <laughs> that didn't work. Uh, Aaron was worried about probably canceling his shows for the rest of the season. But, I had a few tricks up my sleeve. In my bag of tricks. So I set him up with something else. This is brand new for him. <laughs> uh, so his show will go on for now was a different broadcaster. Um, he's having camera issues now, but he'll get them sorted out. Um, like I said, uh, just have nothing but issues tonight. <laughs> um, I think he said he had a camera die on him. Or something, I don't know, something happened to one of his cameras. He's got to reconfigure all of his cameras and reset things and this and that. So, he's back on the air for now with a different broadcaster. Uh, he's using a program called XSplit Broadcaster. It has uh, capabilities of up to 12 video source inputs. Um, it will work with Manicam as a camera input. Um, for any effects or anything that you want. Um, also, if you had Manicam and you needed more inputs or whatever for video, you can use Manicam or point Manicam to uh, XSplit and have XSplit handle all the uh, video switching and what have you. Um, but you can have, well, any you can have, up, like I said, up to 12 different uh, video sources 
and any one of them could be a picture of whatever you know it could be you know like Aaron has color bars and I use color bars on mine which is a picture uh, you can load that up as one of the sources or uh, whatever um, it also handles IP cameras if you got wireless cameras uh, it also supports those and you can control uh, somewhat of the controls like zoom and this and that with it but you're limited I would suggest a webcam XP for that which that's what it's for is a remote camera operation software um, but he, he's back on for now just a little update video um, hope things continue as uh, planned here he's doing a test show here I know this is Tuesday but <laughs> he's doing a test show because I just got him set up with mine and I just left blog TV myself here about 10-15 minutes ago and I had like a seven and a half almost eight hour show <laughs> uh, so anyway um, I helped Aaron during my show, so yeah. I was multitasking. Going crazy. But it was worth it. It's what we're all about. Helping friends out. When we can. Alright guys. That's just an update. I know Aaron's probably posted a video or two. I haven't checked YouTube yet, but I'm sure Aaron's probably posted a couple of notices on YouTube. I know he just posted a few on Facebook, but you know, different updates there. But I'm doing a video update. <laughs> uh, so, and then you can see him sitting there, and uh, I don't know if he's going to do a video while he's on a test show or not, but you know. If he does, he does. If he don't, he don't. That's up to him. Can't control what he does or doesn't do. Um, but, yeah, he's on and he's working. <sighs> don't forget, rate, comment, subscribe there, YouTube. Share it on Facebook, Google+, Twitter, whatever. Share it. Once again, I do take a request on my show, on Blog TV. Aaron takes requests on his show for Blog TV. UXW Bill does too. So does Weasel. Uh, we're going to have a couple newcomers here to the Blog TV scene here pretty soon too. So more on that as it uh, develops. Also, Windows Machine does request too. So, alright guys. Coming up on the 9 minute mark. I will see you guys later. See ya.